Despite his vulnerable beginnings, naked and afraid, washed up on the riverbank, Nathan's feeling a lot more confident now. He's, uh, he's spent the best part of two days already um, learning about this new situation he finds himself in, with the undead walking the earth, with creatures seemingly not of this world, and with feral humans out to uh, do serious damage to him. He's put together some kit, a half pike and a sling, a staff sling, which has fared him well this past day against the threats that are out there. Welcome back to Cataclysm Naked and Afraid. You can see I've done a bit of sorting here. Um, on this tile, we've got our ammo and weapons. On this tile, we've got uh, clothing. Now, there is something very, uh, very cool here. It's the fast draw holster, which is described as a comfortable quick draw holster for small guns. However, uh, yeah, well, let's wear that. We will wear the fast draw holster. And if we go to this tile and try to pick up this uh, SIG P226, that's the gun, isn't it? It is described as a, uh, as a, oh, okay, it was a short recoil operated semi-automatic pistol with a volume of 0.55 liters. I believe this does not fit in the quick draw holster. Wherever the uh, that quick draw holster is, fast draw holster. Yeah, it's empty. So where has the gun gone? It's in the hoodie. Why is that? 0.5 liters. Uh, is it because your capacity, your 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 volume is too small? 0.49 liters compared to the size of this, which is 0.55. Yeah, that's why. Okay. So our, our gun does not fit in our fast draw holster, unfortunately. Let me drop the uh, the gun again. I would like to favorite it, but I would still like to drop it. And we'll drop the fast draw holster back on this tile. Because that's not much use to us yet. These are all being worked with zones. I've got a guns and ammo uh, tile there, as well as weapons. And clothing, armor, and magazines are up on that one as well clothing and armor on this one here. But I think the thing to do for, for Nathan now is to get some food, get some sleep, and uh, keep going at it in the morning. We've just got the doctor's office left to do on that street. So I think, yeah, we'll have another BLT. Because these have been very good. And we'll have uh, uh, a mineral water. Yes. And I think, how are we doing? For rest, we're not uh, we're not doing too bad at the moment. We uh, we could go a bit longer, but we've lost light. I've also moved the uh, the brazier outside. I'll say we've lost light. Losing light is a good thing. We may as well head down to the doctor's office now and see if we can get in and out under the cover of darkness. If we see any threats along the way, then. Uh, We'll have some concerns. We did see the the zombie, the, the crowd of zombies moving along to the north of these houses last episode. They should still be around here somewhere. Uh, they were all going after the giant caterpillar we saw here. So um, hopefully they're not going to push too far in this direction. This is the main reason I want to build a wall on that one side of uh, light industry. Because I think if we had a wall, we'd be a lot safer. Okay, to the doctor's office then. Bear in mind, we can't see anybody yet. Okay, we're inside here. How much noise does closing this make? Nine. Uh, do we attempt the torch at all? I'm not hearing anything. We see Alpha Male Quarterly, a full-size glossy men's magazine. There's a brief article about hiking and a list of simple wilderness survival tips. Yeah, um... Could be useful. Archery for kids could be useful. Swim planet, maybe. I'll grab them. Grab them because I may as well right now. There's also a beauty magazine, which uh, patterns and basic sewing tips. Yeah, that could be useful. As well as outdoor adventures I'll take. Okay. What looks to be a reception area. Laptop computer there. I'll take that since I can 
fit it anyway. For the time being, we may as well examine this vehicle. It uh, The seat is busted. It's got an extra light frame, four inch casters. Yeah, I think... Um... So we're on the seat. Can I drive this thing? No vehicle controls found. That's fine. So how do you move this? How do you use the uh, the thing as a vehicle? I don't know. Something in that bathroom. That door is locked. Over here, we've got another locked door, another locked door. This one opens. And in here we find a broom, another broom. You know what, I wouldn't mind a broom for bashing these doors open, if that was my only option. Which it is, but it's not really, we can smash some windows. Should we take a look around the outside first? We'll do that. Leave that door open for the time being. And go around the back. We can smash that window, it gets us into what may be an office. Okay. Pretty clear around here so far. I'm not hearing any noise out there. Bear in mind we're in a dangerous area now. There's a drain pipe up as well. Okay, nothing around the outside there. What's this? I think it, it looks like it's maybe just a kitchen. Yeah. Okay. Head back in. I'm going to drop my, uh, well, we'll drop it somewhere much nearer by, actually. We'll drop it right here. Drop the homemade half pipe because I'm going to take a broom. Wield the, uh, what's it count as? Just other, okay, there we go. We're wielding the broom, and uh, I'm going to use that to try and bash my way into the kitchen. It's working. Okay, we're through. On the table here... Yeah, nails. There's some peanuts, splintered wood. I'll just take the peanuts. Uh, there's a lighter with a lot of fuel. We've got Alpha Male Quarterly, which we've already picked up, right? Cobb Monthly. An in-depth look at various styles of close quarters fighting. Okay, that could be useful. Crafty Crafters, I think we've already got. Glamopolitan. This is a full-size glossy woman's magazine. There are a few unoriginal recipes and some simple cooking tips somewhere in between the fashion photos. Uh, yeah, cooking tips. We'll take that then. Guide to advanced emergency care we'll take. US Weekly, what's that? Weekly news about a bunch of famous people who are all undead now. We'll leave that behind. In the fridge. Crispy cranberry, dark cola, lemon and lime soda. Rotten milk, some butter, some cheese sandwiches, and some clean water. Always good to have. There's a microwave here. And a steak knife there. Another steak knife. I might grab the steak knives, actually. Because they are useful for, um... Yeah, for all sorts of reasons. Should we smash this door? Let's do it. I'm not hearing anything coming from further in here. Is my broom... I'm on... No, I'm still holding the broom. Uh, come on. This one does not want to smash. What about this one? Okay. We're through. Why is the other one tougher then? That's locked. That's locked. That's locked. They're all locked. Okay. I really want to know why this one is not working. Oh, it's just taking longer, that's all. And the broom is damaged. That's okay, there's another one. Okay, my breath has given out. The broom is still there, it's still working. Let's get our breath back. Keep smashing. There we go, we're finally through. Okay, and what have we got here? What appears to be a staff room. Vodka, another laptop computer. With a medium battery, we can probably recharge. A survivor's note. See? Now I'm just not sure where I'm putting all these storage batteries in my body. See, now I'm just not sure where I'm putting all these storage batteries in my body. Interesting. I don't actually understand that note. Maybe it uh, relates to... Bionics or something? I don't know. 
We won't take it. We will take the USB drive and this software and the other USB drive. I'm always taking these, I don't know why. We've got a phone book, another survivor's note. There's nothing wrong with eating people if you have to. I mean, I only did it because I didn't want to waste my potato chips. Okay then. So, some people have resorted to cannibalism. Uh, already. And I believe, do bear in mind, a massive stack of medical records that contain every gory detail. Patient treatment records. Now, I think they're useful for a mission. Of course, Nathan doesn't know that. Transition glasses, refillable lighter. We'll take... Nothing else there. No, nothing else there. Door hinge nail, splintered wood. I mean, the nails are good. We might take the nails, actually. That one nail. And, uh... This one nail. We've got more here, right? Yeah, two more nails there. Uh, another nail there. These are just very useful. Okay, let's keep smashing our way through um, these other doors. It seems like we're alone in here. It's just... It's barely doing a thing, is it? That'll be because the uh, the actual broom itself is only, yeah, three bash. Uh, we'll take the nail. Splintered wood, is that any better? Four bash, okay. Planks, 16 bash, we should switch to a plank. Okay, let's switch to wielding a, is it under other again? It's under spare parts. Wield a plank, please. Drop the broom. Yes, because the, uh, the plank is just better. It's a doctor's office. With some antiseptic. That's very useful indeed. We'll take that. Okay, we should be able to smash through this one a lot quicker. Yes, there we go. Take the nail. Take the other nail. Remember that the half pike is back in... Um, is back where? Stethoscope, awesome. We'll take that, absolutely. Yeah. We're going to use that to try and crack some safes, finally. Remember that the halfpike is back in the corridor. Because that is essential. We can't leave without that. And if we need it, then, uh, yeah, we ought to... Uh, ought to have it ready to fight, really. We're feeling refreshed. Let's keep smashing, then. Yeah, oh yeah, the plank is working a lot better. We'll take the nail... And uh, we'll take the nail from there as well. Okay, some more doors. A computer system I don't really want to mess about with. It's asking if I want to bypass security. I don't know anything about computers. Well, Nathan doesn't know anything about computers. Uh, so we're going to bypass security. No. Or just quit. Quit. Okay. We're good. Uh, obviously I can't do anything with this uh, metal door here. Which is a shame. Oh, that'll be controlled by this computer terminal. Okay, well, we're going to need something that can hack in order to deal with that. There's an anesthesia kit here. There's an anesthetic. I don't think we need that. An arm splint and two leg splints. Those are useful if we ever have any broken limbs. We don't at the moment. An IV bag with saline solution, which is sterilized water and salt for intravenous infusion or washing contaminants from one's eyes. Uh, yeah, we don't need that. We will, of course, take the antiseptic. Okay, what else have we got? Soap bar. You can also, if I sit here, examine. You can use the, uh, the autodoc. However, it warns that there's an operator missing, and using the autodoc without an operator can lead to serious injuries or death. By continuing with the operation, you accept the risks and acknowledge that you will not take any legal actions against the facility in case of an accident. And of course it describes its supplies. It can choose a bionic module to install, choose an installed bionic module to uninstall, splint broken limbs, treat wounds, check radiation level, or conduct blood analysis. I'm curious about treat wounds. I wonder if it would get our torso back up, but I'm... I'm 
I'm put off by the, uh, the description that it could cause serious injury or death. So, uh, I don't really want to do that. We'll take this nail, of course, and, uh, another two there. Head on upstairs. Okay, we don't see anything or anyone out there. It's just us, seven files and a hole puncher. Three twenty dollar currency straps. A quarter NSD memory card and a USB drive. We've got a file and three flyers. A family photo. Do we get a description of that? A photo of a smiley family on a camping trip. One of the parents looks like a cleaner, happier version of the person you know. I don't think I would have known this person. SD memory card encrypted? We'll take that. I don't know if we can do anything about encrypted, but um, maybe, and it's worth a look. So in this last room here, we've got another auto dock with an anesthesia kit and some uh, more splints. We've got an emergency oxygen pack. A small tank of compressed medical oxygen with a folding re regulator and mask. Commonly used in emergency situations, it provides immediate relief for asthma attacks or smoke inhalation, and can provide a brief burst of energy. Interesting. Useful. Useful. There's also an IFAC pouch with bandages. Bandages. Medical gauze. Medical tape is not as useful, but we'll take it. Medical gloves I can't imagine are useful. They're probably rubber, so they probably don't conduct electricity. I mean, they're probably like rubber latex, right? Or latex. Yeah, latex. Which... I believe won't conduct electricity. Yeah, it does not conduct electricity. So good for, yeah, if we were ever wielding a metal weapon and using that to fight uh, shockers. I'll take them. Pair of scissors, hemostatic powder, which is, we know, uh, good for stopping bleeding. Water purification tablet. Now that is, that is useful. And another tourniquet. I'll take that. We've also got some aspirin, some codeine, some antibiotics, and a syringe, which could have a use. I'm going to leave it. Okay. That room is clear. This appears to just be a bedroom. This appears to just be a bedroom as well. In this book, written primarily for young adults, a woman's modest summer internship results in an incredible discovery that attracts the attention of unsavory elements. Okay, so that's just a novel. And this room is empty. Okay. What else can we see? We can just sort of see out to the roof here. That's it, though. We got what we wanted from here, though, which is a stethoscope. And I think that's it. That's all we wanted to get for now. Go back to wielding our homemade half pike. Dropping the plank. No more doors to bash. And we will zombie child immediately outside. Okay. Um, I'd prefer for you to come for the door. 39 sound. Do not love that you did that. Heading for a run. Out through the door. We just need to get away from here. Um, I might deal with you as I go. That's a miss. Still at a run. Take another swing. That's a miss as well. Oh, these are all missing. That's a hit. That's a miss. Come on. Sound in that house to the north, which the, there wasn't anything in there previously. Okay, you go down. Let's go to a walk. Take a step closer. See if you had anything useful. Basketball. High quality size 7 indoor basketball. I You can't use it, which is a shame. You'd think you'd be able to play with it and like get, um, get your mood up. But no. I wouldn't mind it. It'll probably deconstruct into rubber. That's about it. You were in a school uniform, it looks like, as well. Necktie. Wool socks. Yeah. 
take the bas basketball and smash what remains of uh, the zombie child there. What is going on here? Why... Why am I hearing something from this house? Okay, let's uh, go back to a run. Get away from that window. We've been in there. Oh wait, are the zombies up from the basement? It could be. Really could be, couldn't it? Hello? I see you. Yeah, would you like to uh, uh, get a little closer to me, my friend? Wait, am I hearing something from outside now? Oh, no, 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 no. That was a mistake. Coming in here was a mistake. Oh, here's a question, right? Okay. There were three zombies in the basement. I, I, I remember there being three zombies in the basement. There was also... Oh, like a whole group of them out here, like five to seven or like close to ten zombies out the, the back somewhere in this direction. They could have, um, well, I left this door open. They could have made their way in here somehow. If there's another one that's made it out somewhere over here, it's going to be following my scent. Oh, do I want to stick around and fight? I can outrun you anyway, it's fine. Uh... Come closer. I've got eyes in all directions. Okay, something is definitely coming. Let's go to a run. Disengage. You've grabbed me. Damn it. Um, um, do I hope to just break the grab, or I could take off my um backpack? Would that help me? might. I don't want to leave it behind. Ah, okay, we get away from the grab. Okay. That's another hit. You've clawed at my right arm. Why were you that fast? Um, let's get away. Get away. Take another step. Come on. I should be able to hit you and keep on moving. Okay. That is, that is good. Okay. Oh dear, who else have we got here? Let's go back to a walk. Step to here. See if you had anything good. Uh, I'm not going to take it immediately. You had pretzels, you had a wallet with uh, a decent cash card in there. Let's not smash the corpse just yet. Let's wait and see who else is coming. There's you. We take a swing at you and hit. You are a bit slower than me. I'm going to go to a run just to uh, give myself that extra advantage here. That's a swing. You've grabbed me. Okay, I really need to put my bag down. Let's break the grab and uh, get an extra step away. Ah, oh, come on. Step to there. You should go down to this one. Yep. Okay, good. Is that is that it? I'm hoping that's it. They're the only two that I heard. And you had nothing of interest. Okay. Smash the corpse. We're good. Smash this corpse. We're good. Let's take from the cell phone the light high capacity battery. Might actually take the cell phone anyway. We might get some good stuff from disassembling it. The mini lighter will take, the pretzels will take, the cash card will take. None of the cash is useful. Okay. That I'm happy with. Um Let's drop the homemade half pack for a moment and we will go back to a walk and we will wait until we catch our breath. All of which was apparently safe to do. Good. Go back to, to wielding the homemade half pack. Did you get out somewhere? You did. You smashed that window. I didn't even hear that. I guess that's two of them dealt with. But did they come in via the back or... You know, I don't think so. I think they came in from I think they came up from downstairs and if that's the case there's another one down here oh, I don't want to use the light yet let's uh, peek down what am I seeing here 
nothing. I was thrown off by the little orange icon. Not quite sure what that meant. Um, let's... What are we going to do? Yeah, we're going to go down. I'm going to sneak further into here. Go this way. Is anybody here? There is somebody here. Okay, you are dangerously close to me. Let me go to a run. I'll head this way. Um, take another step. Should be able to get a swing at you there. You've grabbed me already. Damn it! I really need to put my back my bag down. I tried to break the grab, but it fail. Um, okay, as I escape the grab, something falls loose and falls to the ground. That's fine. I don't I don't mind that. That's uh, that's a okay. Uh, I escape the grab anyway, and I keep moving. What what fell? Laptop computer. That is totally fine. Let's just run. Oh no. Okay. Okay. I don't care about a lost computer. That's fine. Oh, just get out. Get out and get up. So, okay, this house was clear. And there are now just more zombies in the basement than than before. This is way too sketchy for, for the time being. I'm going to go back to a walk. Uh, we've still got all our stuff apart from the laptop that we had to drop. That's fine. We're just going to go. We're just going to head back. Uh, everything should be fine. This way should be clear. Despite the very loud noise made by the alarms back at the doctor's office, we should be safe. This way is... Um, this way is clear. Yeah. And just like that, we're back at Light Industry, wherever that is. Yeah. Brilliant. Okay, then. Um, yeah, I did not love that. Okay, we're in mild pain. I'm going to take something for that. I've got some painkillers, right? What painkillers have I got? Aspirin? That'd be good for mild pain. Yeah, we'll just take some aspirin. Take a couple of those, and, uh, yeah. Where was the safe in uh, in these buildings? It's maybe too dark to do anything with it right now. Like, would we be able to see the numbers? It's the other building. Okay. Let's head across there. Whereabouts is it? Okay, it's uh, it's over here. Like I said, it's probably too dark to do this right now. But I wouldn't mind giving it a shot. Attempt to crack the safe. Yes. That is... That is taking a long, long, long time. Honestly, it's taking way too long. How am I? Chilly, thirsty, very hungry. It's morning. With a satisfying click, the lock on the safe opens. I could have cancelled that at any time, I, 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 I realise. I'm tired. I guess we're sleeping through the day then. Okay, so Nathan just spends all night... Um, All night cracking a cracking a what? An empty safe. Oh, how disappointing. There's really there's nothing to grab nearby. I can examine. No, I can't. I can just craft at the table, that's it. There's nothing here. I spent all night working on that. Uh, I wonder would it have been quicker if we did it in the the daylight? Possibly it would have. But it's what we've been working towards. It's why we wanted to get to the doctor's office and get that stethoscope. It just um was all for naught. There are a couple more safes we can try. But um yeah. I think we need to focus on computers and hacking as well eventually um, I would like to find the stethoscope and uh, mark it as a favorite so that we don't drop it because I think it's going to be useful to keep a hold of that uh, almost everything else I'm happy to I think drop so let's do that done We've got a lot of things that we could just disassemble if we wanted to just a lot of things um, 
It's too dark, though, because I've boarded up the windows now, which is a shame. There are other places we can go. We can take all our stuff around the corner into this room where it is lighter. But let's talk... Uh, I don't know. I think we need more... We need more planks anyway, don't we? So we really need to disassemble things. We do have an electric lantern, which takes batteries, and I'm pretty sure we have loads and loads of batteries. What do batteries count as, by the way? I want to check that. Uh, so... Show me... Is it spare parts? I think it might be spare parts. It is, okay. So if we set up a zone, uh, a new zone, for loot spare parts, where's that? Here we go, loot spare parts. And if we put that where? Well, I'd like it to, to stay close to me, close to my like um, crafting area, which I suppose is these squares here. So let's just sort them out into this tile south of me here. And uh, yeah, done. Save those changes and we will do some zone activity. Sort out my loot, static zones only. All the spare parts and everything gets sorted to where it needs to go. So now on this tile here... Oh yeah, we've got so much battery. We've got so much light battery. We also have a, a battery charger, we have to remember as well. Which can be activated from in here, presumably. Not sure. Um, but they will work for the electric lantern. Which is not showing up. Ah, because this is, yeah, not showing all. Electric lantern, there it is. The electric lantern takes what? Oh, it takes an ultralight battery. We don't have many of those. We have one ultralight battery. With 23 charge. So the electric lantern might be a no-go. We're very thirsty and very hungry. Let's go deal with that immediately. Um, no, not pick up. Eat. The BLTs are cold, but I mean, they taste great cold, don't they, right? Vegetable salad is cold. I mean, yeah, this is all going to last a while longer. Are we just going to subsist on BLTs constantly? Let's have a BLT, vegetable salad, and we'll drink some clean water. And a bit more. And that's all very satisfying. And uh, Nathan will get some sleep and rest. Rest until he's... Uh, he's had enough, I think. Don't set an alarm. We fall asleep quite easily. It's dark enough. It's quiet enough. There's nothing else around. We sleep through the AM and hopefully wake up sometime in the afternoon. Yeah. We've completed the achievement the first day of the rest of their unlives. I think we're on a... Uh, we're really on the third day though, aren't we? Okay. It is... Yeah, 4.30 in the afternoon. I think that's good. I think we we want to have the afternoon for working and have the afternoon at the evening for uh, for continued raiding. But while there's daylight, I think we do want to go back and check. We're very hungry though. Let's go back and eat first. We will eat. Will we have another BLT? We'll always have BLTs, man. There's actually a bunch we can make as well. Uh, food-wise, if we stand here and uh, head across to food, we can make bird food, candied honey, fruit juice. We can make uh, a boring sandwich, a cheese sandwich, a honey sandwich, a jam and butter sandwich, jam and cheese sandwich, jam sandwich, meat sandwich. There's a, oh, there's a bunch of options, actually. Um, I'm just going to eat the BLTs for now. We're going to have to sort our food situation out as well. We really need to sort out the space. A lot more. Because we can't just be working in this area. I think with there being no source of uh, 
water immediately close to us. If we are going to be here in the long term, I think we want to build a, um, is it a well. Yeah, build a water well. We can build a covered well if we have 40 rocks. We also need survival of four, fabrication of four. And it requires a pit first. But we can make a a covered well and then uh, turn that into a wooden well with a bucket that would then mean we can draw water from it. takes eight hours, so it would take a day of work, but we could do that. It takes about ten hours for the whole craft to be completed. But it's it's uh, it's an option. These aphids have moved, which usually means they're fleeing, but they don't appear to be moving at the moment. They appear to be quite chill. Okay, ignoring them. Ignoring them and heading back... Uh... I don't know where to today. Lawn mower. I think I want to go and try to disassemble this lawn mower. If I've got the tools for it. If, if not, we can head back home and grab the tools. Because I think we should have everything we need to do that. It's just in the basement here. Yeah, it's right here. Lawn mower. I can't see to craft. What if we had a... Uh... Yeah, well, what if we had a torch on? Okay. Lawn mower, lawn mower, lawn mower. We would get... Oh, we already know this, don't we? Yeah. We knew this already. It would take 45 minutes. I'd rather... You know, I'd rather take it... Upstairs. Uh, I've also got a filter on, don't I? Yeah. Let's just move it for the time being off the shelf. With it off the shelf, I can haul it and I can take it upstairs. You know what else might have a motor? Let me just leave that here. What else very likely has a motor, in fact, is the washing machine. Assuming we can actually... Uh... No, we can't. I think it's probably under deconstruct simple furniture, something like that. Uh, which is usually close to the top here. Deconstruct furniture would take 20 minutes. Certain terrain and furniture can be deconstructed without any tools. It takes 10 minutes. What can we deconstruct that's simple? Is that the tumble dryer? Connect household washing machine to grid. Now that's a washing machine. What's this then? Sorry, what is, uh, what's this? That's the dryer. Okay. Okay, so what is, um, uh, what's the complicated furniture then? The dryer is a complicated piece of furniture. We can deconstruct the washing machine. Okay. Let's quickly do that then. Since we can deconstruct it simply, why not? That gets us a household washing machine, which does not fit in any pocket. Okay. Uh, but we'll move it to uh, to tile 6. <sighs> we'll see if we can actually disassemble it any further. Household washing machine would get us copper tubing, electronic scraps, rubber hose, one small electric motor. And it would take two hours to do. But I think we can do it. Okay. Let's take this up. Uh, where's the best place going to be for us to do this? Zombie spotted. I will... Yes, stop moving items. I will turn off my damn flashlight. Okay, you're out there, you're coming in. Fine. I am wielding my half pack, right? Yes. Good stuff. So, I'm happy to get a little closer to you. Here we go. We do some damage. Step away. Uh, we can still reach. We can still do a bit more damage. Step away. Step away. Uh, I miss. Step to here. Come on. Closer. There we go. You go down. 
You had catalytic cracking at home for solar punks. Colorful textbook that claims that to teach one how to bootstrap kerosene and diesel production from waste products. Wow, okay. Hey. That's not bad. Let's take that. There's a note here. A scrap of paper stuffed in a book. It mentions some locations you might be able to find a reactor, like one described on this page. Oh? Okay. There's also um, there's a map I haven't read back at uh, back at the base. I should do that soon. Another wallet with a cash card, and it looks like nothing else of use to me. Okay. Done. We'll have to look at that note though. Uh, what's uh, what's here? Yes, this is the the washing machine. Let's keep hauling. Uh, we're in a pretty vulnerable spot if we do it right here. I'm going to take it around here. To the kitchen. Should have plenty of light here if we want to try and disassemble it. It would take... Did it say two hours? It's too long, honestly. Where is it? Um, find washing machine. Household washing machine. Time to do this is going to be two hours. I think what we want to do is we want to take it back home first. Yeah, and we'll leave the lawnmower because we know... Right, we'll take this outside. How much is it costing me? It's 448, 20, 23. It's costing me a few seconds each step. That's okay. There's another zombie spotted. Um, no, I'll ignore this and continue. That's fine. I just want to get it to... Yep. Get it to out front, right here. Has the zombie seen me? It has. Wonderful. Okay, I have stopped hauling. Close this door. I don't think we need anything else from in there, so... Let's just deal with the zombie. Uh, not entirely sure where. Yeah, I'll come around this side and meet you. I'm aware, I'm aware. It's right there. Come on, okay. The, the worry is that they are... There's really just the one. But the worry is that they're 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 close now. Okay. Oh god. I want. Yeah, that's a good line. Let me get away from you. Take another swing. Let you catch up. Uh, that should be good. What did you have? Smartphone. I'll take. Talking doll may have a battery in it. Let me just sort this a bit differently. Ultra light. Ultra light is good. Uh, rolling papers. I guess we'll take the rolling tobacco as well. If we come across any other NPCs that smoke, then uh, I think that's useful for them. Okay, nothing else of uh, value. There is a military rucksack here, which is very good if we wash it up, but I think we've already got some better kit than that. Okay. I don't know where these zombies are coming from, though. That's, that is a concern. We'll get rid of the note for the lawnmower, because we've got a washing machine now which we can get a motor from. Also, you know, we should look at these vehicles. We haven't really. There's nothing here to pick up. Uh, okay, what's this then? Right, nothing. Two zombies, what? Where? They're in the forest. Remember, I took the zombie soldier this way, didn't I? To, um... Where's the crater? There's the crater. I took the zombie soldier to there. Could these zombies be the zombies that were led south by the aphids? They could be. Okay, but they're far enough away that I need I can ignore them for the time being. Uh, nothing in this vehicle. We'll go around this way, though. What's here? Just uh, a wheel and a lug wrench, nothing else. Okay. Let's get this home. Is it, all, is it all we want to do? All we need to do right now? Roaches and zombies. Doctor's office will have attracted a lot of attention. Yeah. I think this is all that we want to do for the time being. Get this home. See if we can get a motor out of it. 
And if we can, then hey, we will be able to um, get that truck working. Actually, that's what I was wanting to do with those vehicles back there, was look at, like, because I can examine the vehicle and I can talk about, like, removing something. Frame, roof. No. What else is there? Refill, mend, repair. We can mend the engine, which is in need of... So I don't think we can take a motor from them. Doesn't seem like it. Let's just get this back. We are just surrounded by aphids. Nothing to be concerned about. Yeah, good stuff. We'll get this back indoors. And uh, find a nice light place to uh, to work on it. Like here would work, but yeah. I don't know. I'm really not sure what I'm going to do with this place, like what's going to go where. But for right now, I want to disassemble the household washing machine. That's begun. Look at night already starting to come in. Drop several items on the desk. Do I? What have I dropped? A small electric motor and a bunch of other stuff. Okay, I'm going to grab the small electric motor. I think I'm just going to haul the rest of the stuff back over to my uh, big old um, stuff pile right here. Whoops, that's everything. Uh, we can sort that really quickly, hang on. Yeah, there we go. Now, oh hang on, there's a bunch more that we want to drop to do that. Okay. Let's see if we can, in no wait, hang on, I've obviously if I've dropped everything just now, I've dropped the motor to um, motor. Let's grab that. Let's see if we can't do something with this then. Okay. Mend. Mend the engine. Replace faulty starter motor. Okay, we just need fine bolt turning of one or more. But we've got a small electric motor now. Okay. Ah, fine bolt turning. What's got fine bolt turning? I reckon advanced inventory management has these filter options, like... Ah, yeah, if I search for quality, fine, bolt, turning, can you see anything? Oh, uh, what if it's on all? The adjustable wrench, okay. We will pick up the adjustable wrench. We will put that in our inventory, done. In fact, I guess we should uh, favorite it since it is so useful. Where is it? There it is. Favorite that. What this means is we're about to get a car working. I think. Unless we need mechanics of three. Can we attempt it without Mechanics of 3? You are currently unable to mend the faulty engine this way. Okay. I need Mechanics up. Right. Uh, so, right, that's the next thing to do is grind Mechanics, I guess. How do I get Mechanics up, I wonder? Well, I mean, there are a lot more books in here and, and stuff. Let's grab this book, for example. Um... No books in there, no books on the shelf. Let's just grab every book we can, I think, because I don't know um, that there'll be anything here for mechanics, but I think it's going to be the best way to try and grind it is by having all of the books and taking a look at what they can do for us. Obviously, some of these aren't going to help us, like that Mountain Man one I just picked up. Uh, just glass shards. I mean, glass shards can be useful. You know, we'll take a look at what we can uh, craft and or disassemble as well. SICP, was that? Yep, no idea what that is. Oh, I also said we're going to look at the, the note and the... Uh, I've got another note as well somewhere. Which is just a survivor's map. 
kind of thing somewhere. I think that's it. For all the books we've got here, that's that's everything. So drop those on my big pile, and uh, we will do what? Because we don't have light to read here. No. So, you know what? We'll create another sorting zone for uh, books. Not magazines, because magazines is um, something else entirely. Let's add books. We'll put them... Actually, yeah, we'll put them in the corner on the table here. Just for the time being. So if we want to... No, because there's... Tom, there's no light there. It's fine. We'll do it. We just want to sort them out for the time being. Is there anything else? Like, uh, books? There's also manuals is another another one, isn't it? Magazines is gun magazines, so not that. Manuals and maps as well, probably. Let's put manuals in the same place. Uh, we'll add another one for maps. I think that's everything. There's also flyers, is there not? There's not. Uh, I'm not seeing any of the, like, readable things. Maps. Maps. Put those there. Okay. I don't know what a note count says. But we'll see if it actually sorts this out. Yes. So let's do the sorting. Uh, like so. Everything gets sorted out. What gets put here? Ah, the note and the survivor's note are both there. Conway Urban Explorer's map is there. Good stuff. That's excellent. Uh, I would like to have some light, but we'll we'll talk about that in a second. First thing I want to do is look at is there anything I can actually craft here that would get my um Yeah, primary skill used to craft. Mechanics? Methanol fuel cartridge. Ten thousand methanol. Yeah. We have zero mechanics at the moment. What's this? A double slam fire pipe shot gun. Double slam fire. A crude shotgun composed of four thick steel pipes, two end caps, and two nails. The lack of sights make this weapon only useful at point blank range. Okay, so it's a strong but ineffective shotgun. And it requires two slam fire pipe shotguns in order to Alright. Okay. I can't make that. Whatever. Interesting. Okay, so I, there's nothing I can do to grind mechanics up in there. I'm going to have to... I really... I think I'm going to have to read about it, aren't I? Well, that sucks. Okay, let me haul my books into a space where I can actually do some reading. Unless it's too late. It's too late at night now. Okay, let's just take them back then. We'll take them back, we'll put them back here. Uh, we'll, we're going to need a, a lantern of some sort, so what have we got? We've got 110 left in the flashlight. We've got plenty of batteries though, so I don't see why we don't just use the flashlight. Yeah, we'll sit here, we'll do some reading. Everything's going to be fine. By the light of the flashlight, nothing should be able to see us. Let's close this door to be sure. But our light should not be shining outside. Let's also close these doors to be sure. And the kitchen. And that one. Okay, but we're sealed in in every direction where there is light. Uh, so let's do some reading. Actually, first of all... First of all, I want to use those notes. Where are they? Uh, there's a note somewhere. Hang on. Yes. Conway Urban Explorer's map. You add roads and abandoned buildings to your map, so what have we got? Zoom out a bit. Has it expanded this at all? I don't know. Maybe. A lot of this we already knew. Yeah. Okay, so that's not really... Uh... So far as I can tell... It's not added much we didn't already know. That's fine. Uh, what else can we do? There's a note here. Read that. Add the locations to my map. Okay. I do not know what that's added. 
like I genuinely don't know what that's added either. It's like, uh, that's not really expanded anything either. It's possible it's added a mission? Should we take a look? No, just reach refugee center. Okay, so I don't know what that's added either. We may take a, a closer look at some point, but there's just... We zoom in over here. I feel like maybe there's some new stuff here. Like, what's this? Desolate barn. Yeah, possibly, because that's off the road. There's a uh, roadside food cart there. I think we already knew about that. There's another desolate barn over here, looks like. Yeah, but the... Um, those notes have not really helped us to expand outwards much, I don't think. They have not, no. Okay. Any other actions we can take here? Is there another note at all? A survivor's note or, or anything like that? Or uh, handmade holy symbol, leather belt, staff sling? No, okay, so I think we're moving on to... That's used, that's used, okay. Well, we can go on to reading the books now. And checking what we've got. Alpha male quarterlies, archery for kids, autobiography of a mountain man, beauty magazine, catalytic cracking at home for solar punks. That could could be mechanics. It can help me craft kerosene, but uh, it requires applied science of five. We do not have that. Okay. Archery, autobiography, beauty magazine, chemistry textbook. That's going to be chemistry. Uh, what is... Is that CQB monthly? It'll help practice melee, beginner. I think we may already be beyond that, actually. Uh, melee to one. We already have three. But it would be fun to read. Three crafty quarters, quarterlies. Crafty, that's going to be fabrication, probably. Dainty dishes, discobolus. Electronic circuit theory. Could that be mechanics? Maybe. Advanced Emergency Care, Guns and Ammo, Outdoor Adventures, SICP, that I'm not sure about. The Modern Tanner, Welding and Metallurgy, let's look at that one. Can be helped to practice welding, advanced, sure, but it requires fabrication of four. Okay, we're not far from fabrication of four, though, so we might be able to get to that. I don't know what it'll train up, though. Well, yeah. Probably fabrication, right? If that's the required skill. What about that other one? Electronic circuit theory. Electronics of three required. Okay, so nothing for mechanics yet. Huh. SICP, I didn't know. It says computer advanced. Yeah, okay. Computers of five are needed. That is pretty high. We've got... Uh, let's just check the rest as well. Get through these really quick. Because it's very quick to check what you can learn from something. It's a bit... Uh, it takes a bit longer to actually read it for learning purposes. Okay. Survival to one, fabrication to one. Archery, food handling, survival, tailoring, melee, fabrication, throwing, food handling, marksmanship, survival, athletics, and the rest require some skill we don't yet have, and none of them are mechanics focused. Damn, okay. Right. And all of these, we've already got the skill, but some of them do have recipes that we don't know worth hanging on to anyway. Oh, that sucks so much. Okay. Drop them all and uh, sort them back into their space. Okay. That sucks. So what can we do? What can we do to like get mechanics up then? All we want to do is install this motor. Hmm. Might have to look into that. Because right now my mechanics skill is zero. Zero and zero percent. So that's going nowhere right now. Damn, okay. We should see what I can do with a laptop as well if it's in here. 
We can read stored books, use SD card apps, manage external storage, play a game, or light up the screen. Let's do... SD card apps? Download data from memory card? You don't have the necessary item at hand. Do I not? What if I picked up, say, a... Because uh... all, all of the cards are here, right? Two memory cards, that one's clean. That one's encrypted. These are cardboard boxes. There's clean. Okay. Oh, were they on USBs instead? They may have been on, on USBs. Manage external storage. You don't have any empty book storage devices. Do I not? I would have thought I had, like, USBs aplenty because I've been picking them up. However, they do have software on them. Oh, wait, hang on. If I find, say, a, a, a USB... Uh, okay, I can't use a USB. Why not? Why the heck not? So let's grab, if we can, any USBs from here. Oh, we've just got two plain ones and then one with... Well, two with MISC software. Can we pick up one of those and... See if it's usable at all? Where is it? USB drive MISC software. What can we do with that? Activate it? You can't use it there. Really? What can I do with it? Read, wheel, throw, drop. Oh, hang on. What if... Okay, so what if... Have I got the laptop on me at the moment? Or no? I do. So what if I were to... Let's see. Let's think about this. Yeah, go into my inventory, find the laptop, uh, and then say I'd like to... Oh, reload is something I can do? I was looking for insert, like it's a pocket. Activate, read, eat, where? Wield, throw, change side, take off. Drop, unload, reload, part reload, mend, disassemble, favorite, View recipe, hide content, show contents, reassign. Okay, let's try reload. You reload the laptop computer with medium battery. Damn. Of course that's what that does. How do I get the USB drives to even work then? I've got some MISC software I could check, and I'm, I'm not sure. Oh well. I think we'll, uh, we'll drop everything in that case, yeah. Drop everything. Okay, in the next episode, Nathan's gonna have to focus. On, why am I? Why am I heading out there like that? That's terrible. Yeah. Okay. Darkness has fallen now. Yeah, we'll leave dealing with mechanics until the next episode because I, I I don't know how I'm gonna grind that up yet. I do wonder what what we want to do is like a last thing. I mean, we could go for a wander down that street. I do somewhat worry about all the zombies we've been seeing. Where did they come from? Why are they back? Because I cleared the house to the south. In fact, this street is very clear. I know that much. Apart from the zombies in the one basement. This vehicle. Can I uh, learn a bit more about you? Lacks the wheels. Dented. What have you got here? Bottle jack, lug wrench. A plastic jerry can with gasoline. So good. So good. We'll take that. Uh, what else? We come to... We're passing... Yeah, we've passed the playground. Passing the doctor's office now. There's another row of houses here. Which we could start working on. Across from them, there's a museum. Tempted by the skate park right now. Though I do know there are zombies in the area. I'm going to be very careful as I press into this area here. I should see any zombies before they see me, though, so. That's like a limousine or something, right? It's like a large bus. We can't actually get into the back from here. Uh, I see more gasoline. Okay. Let's get around the back. Oh, it's a van. It's just a van. What have you got? Just a bottle jack and... Okay. 
Like I said. Okay. I do have the pike, don't I? Yeah. So you're easily dealt with, my friend. However, a group of you are not. Okay. Well, I might just climb the fence then. I think I can do that. Get across. Grab some uh, knee pads, sure. Uh, I see the zombies, yep. Yeah. Grab some roller skates, they're a poor fit. Might be better ones around. What if I looked here? Hang on, ignore the zombies. Step to here. I hear clang. Yeah, because they're, they're beating up the fence over there. I think I can go down here, right? You can't, okay. Ooh, hello. Ooh, yeah, these, these tiles are a bit weird. Some more skates over here. Ooh, be careful. Pair of roller skates that are a poor fit. Pair of knee pads. I think we just got some knee pads, right? Yeah. So I don't care about the extra ones of those. Pair of roller blades that are a poor fit. Pair of roller... Sorry, what? Roller blades that are a poor fit, yeah. Oh, is that it? That's a shame, huh? Uh, okay. Any more around the outside? No, they've crashed through the fence over here. You're a tough zombie. Ignore and continue over here. You should not see me. This is what? This is a metal bench. Okay. A pair of roller skates that are a poor fit. Roller skates that are a poor fit. Roller blades that are a poor fit. I don't think I've checked these ones, have I? Roller skates that are a poor fit. I'm going to take these roller blades. I'd like to have a pair. They're obviously not um, that useful to me if they're a poor fit, but we might be able to refit them. Okay. Doctor's office cleared. Actually, we should uh, mark that as explored. The skate park we have explored as well, so do that. Just houses along this road, all the way down. Museum, pond, house. Open sewer. Gun store. Military surplus. And we get back into more dangerous territory over here when we left it. But we're feeling a lot more confident now that we've got the 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 pike and the well, the half pike and the uh, the sling, the staff sling. Just wonder if this is what we want to be doing right now. Okay. I mean, it is easy for us to uh, to do, to just we'll head out this way. I know there were zombies out here uh, another time. You've seen me, so yeah. Get closer. Wait. Sorry, I've, I've made a mistake, friend. Uh, let me drop my... Where's my backpack? There it is. The encumbering me a lot, that. Hello. Get closer. Thank you. Swing. That's a hit. You should be slower than me, despite your quickly uh, getting into my range there. Oh, come on, get away from me, thank you. Okay, that's a miss. You go down, good. You had a, a, a really nothing of useful stylish wallet, had cash card, and that's it. Smash the corpse, done. Don't forget the backpack. Let's leave it right by the skate park for now. See if anyone else is around. I see a zapper zombie, but it's miles away. What's this? A rock I'll take. Okay. Oh, hello. Another zombie. I wouldn't mind getting your attention. Thank you. Come with me, then. That's a miss. Up closer to me, thank you. That's another miss. That's a hit. <laughs> Done. You had nicotine gum, a stylish wallet with another cash card. We've got so much cash on these cash cards now. We have nothing to 
Oh, wow, you had heroin as well. Okay. Leave that alone. Uh, we'll take the smartphone and... Yeah, nothing else. That's it. Okay. Yeah, this is good. This is good. We can do some minor clearing by night. Okay, the area is pretty clear though. Remember that the uh, backpack is around the back of the skate park though. Have you all moved on? Where have you gone? There's one of you. Yes, good, good. Come with me then. Just all on your own. Okay. Oh god, you are a slow one, huh? <laughs> and you go down, messenger bag with a file in it. Neoprene arm sleeves would be quite good. But I'm not going to take them for now. Smash your corpse. Yes, let's stop smashing. And uh, if there's another zombie to deal with, we'll, we'll get closer to you. Yep. Okay. Right, you are you were faster than I was expecting. Uh, come on then. Good stuff. Okay, uh, quickly. There we go. You go down nice and quick. Bike helmet, filthy but useful. Day pack with a laptop computer. A laptop computer has a medium battery. We'll take that. That's it. I will smash your corpse. Go back and finish that one. See how clear the front is now. Zombie spotted. Okay. Come with me. Oops. Okay, you got a little too close there for my liking. Yeah, I don't love when you do that, that sort of perfect diagonal to me like that. Um. Ooh, no, wait, I, I waited two turns there. I should not have done that. Okay. Uh, God damn it. There we go, you go down. You had a messenger bag with file. Uh, you had a leather wallet with a cash card. Nothing else really of value. Chocolate bar, smartphone I'll take. Okay. And apparently I'm still, yeah, able to carry a fair amount here. That's the cargo pants for you though, isn't it? Okay. The front of the skate park is looking pretty clear. I'm hearing brushing, yeah. You're there. Are you alone? You saw me for a moment. Okay. I really should be on the other side of you, but that's, that's fine. Because we don't like stepping into the unknown like that. We'll take the cell phone. The uh, MP3 player, the multi-tool, I think we already have one of those, nicotine gum, and uh, I guess, yeah, the chocolate bar again. Once again, smash the corpse, push up the street, there's another one. Okay. Yeah. Get closer and we'll uh, slowly wear you down. Oh god. That was critical. Oh, you go down. Okay. Anything good on you? You had an MP3 player, you had some tortilla chips, you had a smartphone, and you had a cash card. So many cash cards. Okay. Once again, smash the corpse. I don't know, this is looking pretty clear. Zappa zombie, yeah, I'm already aware of that. The uh, zone of awareness that I have is uh, shrinking slightly though. I think we need to move on. Head back. We've done a little bit of nighttime clearing that's been very good. What are you wearing by the way, Nathan? T-shirt? Like on your torso, I mean. T-shirt, hoodie. Okay, you are wearing more than just a t-shirt. Good. I was worried because I know he's getting chilly. It's where the... Uh, 
the backpack. There we go. And okay, how do we get back from here? I think the rear of the buildings is less safe than the front of the buildings. So I'm going to go back around and down the street. Because I think that's safer. This side, anyway. We haven't actually cleared the uh, children's play park yet. But this side of the street is, is safe. Look at that. So easy. Okay, and in the next episode, like I say, I'm going to have figured out how or what I need to do to get my mechanics up. Because right now I just don't know. Uh, and it seems like shy of a mechanics textbook right now. I just don't have an option. So we're going to leave it here. I will quickly take a look at the map and see if there's anything, say, library. There is a library. So if we, if we do depend on books, we can potentially find the books we're looking for there. But yeah. Shy of using books to get mechanics up, I, I just don't know how to get it up. But we will figure it out next time. In the meantime, thank you so much for joining myself and Nathan for this episode of Naked and Afraid. And ta -ra.